Have you ever wanted to make your own GIF animation? It can be done with one simple command in Linux. Watch this video and start making your own GIFs. Hello everyone, it's Arish Linux user, helping you to install, configure and use Linux. I am sorry for not uploading videos during the last two weeks. There was a sequence of misfortunes. We moved to another apartment and there were some problems with getting internet connection there. It took me a week to fix the internet connection. After that, I caught some flu, so I was sick for another week. But I am back now and new videos will be uploaded as usual, every Wednesday and Friday. I am also still replying all your comments, so if I have not replied your comment, please be patient, I will reply you soon. Now let's get started with how to make an animated GIF in Linux. GIF is a graphics interchange format, basically it is a very simple animation file, as you can see here. If you have visited my website, you should have seen this GIF. I created from these three images. And the way to create it is very simple. You need to install ImageMagick in the Debian based distros such as Linux Mint, Ubuntu, Elementary OS, you can run this command. I copy it to the description. In other distros, the package is also called ImageMagick, so install it using the package manager of your distro. After that, place all the images you want to use for your GIF in one folder, as I have these three images in the folder GIF icons. Next, you open the terminal in that directory and run this command, where delay specifies the amount of time to wait before changing a frame in milliseconds. Loop indicates how many loops to run. The value of zero means to run it infinitely. Press enter. And here's the GIF file. I think most of you will keep loop at zero, whereas the delay can be adjusted to your liking. For example, let's increase the delay to 200. Now the animation is slower. For the better quality, I recommend you to make sure that all your images are of the same size and resolution. It is also good to compress your images as much as possible, because a GIF file may get quite large. But this is a topic for another video. So please subscribe and you won't miss it. I will also make a tutorial on how to extract frames from a video file to make a GIF. So you will truly benefit from subscribing. See you in the next video and thank you for watching.